imagination. You are a part of the creation of all that lies beyond the mysterious beyond. The mysterious beyond. Hello YouTube, this is Trainboy54, and why am I here on the ping pong table, you ask? Well, not only to show you the track layout number two of the 5-in-1 track builder set that I had just set up at the moment, but also what I had got from Walmart is the Trackmaster Steelworks Thomas, and also the film... Disney's Beauty and the Beast. Well, this is a new but a different version of Beauty and the Beast. I can't say I never saw this movie before, but I will now. And maybe I'll do a movie review of this. Well, maybe not. But anyway, let's get to the Steelworks Thomas. This is a new train pack of... The movie, A Journey Beyond Sodor, and, well, I haven't seen the movie yet either. But the set comes with Steelworks Thomas, Steelworks Hurricane, never met him before, or this train, Merlin the Invisible. Well, it says here, in the movie, Journey Beyond Sodor, Thomas travels to the mainland, and discovers a strange place called the Steelwork the Steelworks. I didn't know there was even a Steelworks on the mainland. I thought there was a Steelworks on Sodor. Well, let's just get the Steelworks Thomas out of the box and get a better look at him. So I'm gonna be as well fast as I can. Okay. Well then, let's have a good look at the Steelworks Thomas. Well, Thomas's expression looks not bad. I mean, he's blushing, but he's covered in black soot. His running board is now black. You can barely see his front wheel is black, but the other two wheels are blue, almost. What did Thomas do to his paintwork? It must have happened while he was working at the steelworks. Oh yes, the switch seems to be doing fine. Instructions how to make him, or make him work. I don't think I've ever seen this before. What kind of wagon is this? It's, it's like a pot wagon, but carries something. Depends on what it carries at the steelworks. Oh, and the coupling with these cars are different. It says here on the front of the box. The rocking bucket goes from empty, goes from empty to full. Well, must be either full of something from the steelworks, but it doesn't do anything. Oh well. And lastly, a truck that carries orange steel. Well, it's a good thing it has a rubber band. Oh, I like the colors of the wheels. It's nice to have different colors of the wheel. Oh, it's got steel 
orange metal stuff. Well, it's kind of obvious that this car couples together with the other redesigned Trackmaster Thomas Rolling Stock. Now then, to put batteries in the Steelworks Thomas, or I think I will call it uh, the black soot covered Thomas. Well, whatever you can call it. Leave me a comment in the comment box below. Now then. Put the battery back in. Now let's see if he works. Huh. It works not bad. So. Now we got the strange... A uh, rocking bucket car, plus the truck carrying the orange metal uh, stuff. Now we got Thomas coupled up to these cars. We got the Steelworks Thomas over on layout two of the five and one track builder set. And now let's give him his first test run. So far, so good. Ah, yes. Around this layout of the 5-in-1 track builder set, the Steelworks Thomas goes. Well, overall, I must say, the Steelworks Thomas is, well, pretty much a good train set. I mean, a good train pack. I had train set in my mind. But I'll be looking forward to hopefully get Steelworks Hurricane and Merlin the Invisible, either before or after the movie Journey Beyond Sodor will come out on DVD. In the meantime, I'll be watching Disney's Beauty and the Beast for the first time. And I'll think about doing a movie review of that later. In the meantime, we'll watch Steelworks Thomas going around this layout one more time. So, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more videos coming up from Trainboy54 Productions.